everyone, this is Claudia Mendoza from the Joy of Learning Academy and today I want to uh, show you everything that my preschoolers did during the week. Uh, we were decorating our wall for fall. Atom is here and we decorated based on some of our preschoolers' favorite books. Every week I pull out the books that, um, that are go with the theme of the week and we're talking about fall. And these were my preschoolers' favorite stories. Every day we read about one or two stories and I pick the ones that are they're more interested in and to do my work time. So today I want to give ideas for mom, for teachers, um, based on the stories, what we did and how we decorated our classroom. It's very easy to go buy stuff, but what I like to do is um, have the work of my students display in order to make a decoration. They love to see their work. And also we have to remember about reuse, reduce and recycle. So we don't just teach that during our day, but during um, all the time. And the activities you're gonna see this week are activities that all we use was construction paper, paint, some glue. So very simple, very inexpensive, yet we were able to do something beautiful. Are the stories that my uh, preschoolers enjoy the contest um, the silly scarecrow uh, i'm gonna have a different youtube video where you could see th these uh, stories with more details and why my preschoolers like it um, i highly recommend some of these stories because um, i know children enjoy it i've been teaching for 15 years preschool and i know you could teach many lessons with them the silly scarecrow a clifford um, it's about a puppy, Clifford, who was scared because somebody told him about the, the monster that was on the farm and the monster was just a silly scarecrow. I was able to teach them about feelings and also about not just believing everything that we are told. And I wanted to bring this story out because it has the picture of a scarecrow. We pull out our scarecrows outside for our decorations. Here is a story about autumn first leaf and as we talk about how uh, leaves uh, change, we could talk about feelings, we could talk about empathy and we could also talk about building friendship too. And they got to go explore and find leaves. This one is um, the leaves on the trees. I love this story because this story has um, the shapes of the leaves and my preschoolers were found 13 different types of leaves in my backyard. Maybe they're small, but this is what my preschoolers found. And we were able to compare as when the leaves blew in. And we practiced memory. Um, and this one, we're gonna have a whole week with the legend of a spooky. It says story about a square pumpkin. He found out he was odd, he was rare. And then at the end, we find out how special he is. So we can judge a book by the cover. We can judge a pumpkin by this cover. In September, October, I really want to focus for with my students that are um, between two and a half to four, to four five is their fine motor skills. So we have in these activities cutting, drawing, their art, it's balancing academics with the activities we do. Before we jump into the activities, I want to remind you that if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please subscribe. This will help my channel so I may continue making videos for you.
now we're gonna make our pumpkins. Yeah, like you don't need to buy a cow pumpkin. You can make it yourself. You can get it so white people. I like to do a little thing. I like what I'm doing. I make kind of like a huge apple and then I just make lines in the shape of a pumpkin. Um, I'm gonna do a mad activity with our pumpkins. So I'm gonna make a dot and a number because we're reviewing number one through five. So for this activity, how many seeds are you gonna be, put? Uh, cutting one, and, and then uh, they're gonna be painting. Number three. And we're gonna these brushes and paint. We're gonna do a little bit of science, mixing colors, and yellow and, and red, and see what keep our parents informed we needed to create a bulletin board for the backyard and we use a 99 cents cardboard and some borders simple and nice What's happening, guys? Marble cleaning. You like Hot Wheels? You could put your mask down so we could hear. Yeah. He likes basketball. That's one of his uh, hobbies. And you did it with your brother. You like Hot Wheels? No. Did you like Hot Wheels? That means that your birthday is coming. Yeah, can it's only eight? It's only eight. It's my birthday is only ten years away. Ten days away. Oh my goodness. We're gonna make you a big party here, okay? You like to eat peach and anything else would you like to tell us about yourself? No, so you will get to know you better. Oh no, that's the only thing I love. Oh the cars. Okay, perfect. Even if it's not here, you could tell us it's your chance. Questions about him and see if you guys were listening. How many brothers does what does he like to play? Oh, no, don't say Basketball. He likes basketball, huh? Very good. You are listening. I have wheels. Yeah, he likes peach. He likes car. He likes peach. Hey, you guys were listening. And one more question. When was he born? What month of the year? October. That means he's an October baby. All right, everybody, let's clap for you. Got it. Thank. You. Kelly Lewis. 
What do you guys see in the picture? Leaves. You see leaves, animals. What kind of animals do you see? A cow and a sheep. A cow, a sheep. What else? And a, and a cockatoo. Oh, you a see a, 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 a an animal that goes cuckoo Yeah, there's hey, two. Hey. You see hay? Yeah. Okay, yeah, I see hay too. Hey, hey, hey. Don't worry about you see chickens? Okay. I see chicken. Good job, Matthew. Good eye. Okay. Okay. When the leaf blew in, the cow sneezed. Hachu. I love these pictures. This cow. And when we sneeze, we go hachu. Cover our mouths, right? Can you show me how you sneeze? Hachu. A good thing now we have masks, so we could go hachu. It protects us even better. Okay, so when the cow sneezes, at you, look at the spider. The spider landed on the owl. When the spider, look at the spider. When the spider landed on the owl, the owl took out of the barn. What do you think the word soup means? Because you know the owl went like this, soup out of the barn. Looking at the picture, it shows. Goat. Goat. I wonder what's gonna happen with the goat. When the pig dove into the mud, the goat kicked over the bucket. I think he was scared, huh? He was scared. He was scared, so he kicked. I see another animal right there. A chicken. A chicken. Let's mm -hmm. find out what this pig does. I want to know too. I wonder what he does. <gasps> Look! When the goat kick over the bucket, the chicken span around and around and around. Mm -hmm. There, there you go. This, mm -hmm. this, this page is falling down, so I'm holding it like that. When the chicken span, I see another man's uh, legs of another animal. Horse. A horse. A horse. Yes, it is a horse. I can see it's a horse. You were right. When the chicken span around and around, the horse rear up and yay! And a sheep. And a sheep. Oh, now you see a sheep. Wonder what he's gonna do, and there is a duck. Well, let's see. The horse went. Thank you, Leilani. Okay. Thank you for cutting. Hey, you cut the whole thing. What are you doing, guys? We're cutting. Get different colors. Get different colors. I see. Good job. Get different colors. Who's going to get orange? Oh, Lani, let me see your hands. Ari? Mira que bonito quedó. My hands are very dirty. Wow, it's so green, like the whole. Let's see.
hope you were able to get a lot of ideas like you see you could uh, use uh, many books as your ideas as your inspiration for preschoolers to connect to foster the joy of reading uh, child's imagination your students uh, creativity really to love them and boost their individuality and for them to realize that they're unique they're special and we want to teach them empathy as well uh, see you next time don't forget to see our next video where we're talking about spooky and this book book about acceptance and because it doesn't matter the color we are the shape we are the size we are we're all special and we are unique